Good day, Exo family. Welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's sister location. And I'm sorry, it's been a it's been a few days since I've uploaded a Five Nights at Freddy's video. It's just work. But like I said, I'm gonna do uh, I'm gonna try to do my. I don't know how loud I'm talking to be honest because I have these things like all the way up right now. But anyways, like I said before, I'm gonna try to do my game series videos on the weekends and then just random online live streams with my friends on the weekdays. So, yeah, but it's the weekend, so guess what? Five Nights at Freddy's. All right, so let's jump right into night three. Now we're being introduced to Funtime Foxy. Welcome back to another pivotal night of your thriving new career where you get to really ask yourself, what am I doing with my life? What would my friends say? <laughs> and most importantly, will I ever see my family again? Will I we ever understand see what? the stresses of a new job, and we're here for you. To help you reach a more stable and relaxing frame of mind, oh, no, we offer not several the casual musical selections to help make this elevator ride Sorry, as relaxing and therapeutic really as possible. We offer contemporary jazz, classical, rainforest ambiance, as well as a wide selection of other choices. Thank you for selecting. Using the keypad, it seems you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, and I will auto-correct it for you. Thank you for selecting casual bongos. Few moments later, one eternity later, three days later. Why casual bongos? Like, I seriously do not like bongos. I literally hate bongos. It's one of my catchphrases. You get a bongo, you throw it out the fucking window. But here we are. Now that your elevator experience has been customized to your needs and you're thoroughly relaxed, it's worth mentioning that due to your lackluster performance yesterday, your pay has been decreased by a substantial amount. Please enjoy the rest of your descent. Now I hate bongos even more. Stage. <laughs> Great. It looks like everything is as it should be in Ballora Gallery. Let's no, check on not. Funtime Foxy. It's important to make sure she's on her stage before entering. So it's it's official. Funtime Foxy's a girl. Okay. Great. It looks like everything is as it should be in Funtime Auditorium. Ah, uh, no, it's not. There's no need to check on Baby tonight. Please refrain from entering unauthorized areas. Proceed directly to Funtime Auditorium. Fuck you, you don't tell me what to do. I'm gonna check on baby right now. That's what fathers are supposed to do. They're supposed to check on their babies. I gotta go check on my baby. So, I actually seen this comment that I got on one of my videos to go in here. to shut the door. Did you know that I was on stage once? It wasn't for very long. Only one day. What a wonderful day, though. I was in a small room with balloons and a few tables. No one sat at the tables, though. But children would run in and out. Some were afraid of me. Others enjoyed my songs. Music was always coming from somewhere else. Down a hall. I would always count the children. I'm not sure why. I was always acutely aware of how many there were in the room with me. Two, then three, then two, then three, 
then four, then two, then none. They usually played together in groups of two or three. I was covered in glitter. I smelled like birthday cake. There were two, then three, then five, then four. I can do something special. Did you know that? I can make ice cream. Although I only did it once. There were four, then three, then two, then one. Something happened when there was one. A little girl standing by herself. I was no longer myself. And I stopped singing. My stomach opened and there was ice cream. I couldn't move, at least not until she stepped closer. There was screaming for a moment, but only for a moment. Then other children rushed in again, but they couldn't hear her over the sounds of their own excitement. I still hear her sometimes. Why did that okay. happen? So I'm guessing that's Baby that's talking. And we just heard a story of hers. Circus gallery event. Okay. Well, that was some nice insight. Kind of vulgar detail. Maintenance vent opened. Unlike oh, Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this Andrew reason, Taylor, it's leader, important to keep Marie, the room dark, as welcome. to not accidentally I activate if I, uh, if I You have been provided with already, a flash beacon. I normally do. Use it if you need to get your bearings, and to ensure you don't bump into anything. However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. I forgot about this part! Why is this a thing? Okay, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Stop. Hammer time. Oh, 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 stop. Hammer time. Oh, 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 uh oh, uh oh, <laughs> uh oh, uh oh. Motion oh. Center, parts and service. Great job reaching Forgot parts and part service. Too. It seems that Funtime Freddy is out of power, which should make your job much easier. The release switch for the chest cavity is located on the underside of the endoskeleton jaw. To reach it, we will first need to open the face plates. You will need to press the okay. face plate release triggers in a specific order and it's important to be as precise and as careful as possible. Locate the small button on Freddy's face, just under his right cheek, and press it. Great! Now locate the button under his left cheek and press it. Great! Now carefully locate and press the button next to Freddy's right eye. Great! Now carefully locate and press the button just above Freddy's nose. Oh, shit. Good job. The face plates should now be open. Locate and press the small button on the underside of Freddy's endoskeleton jaw. This one. Excellent. The chest cavity should now be open. Remove the power module from the great work. You will now be required to remove the secondary power module from the Bonnie hand puppet. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Bonnie, you little bastard! You better get back here. Where the hell is that animatronic? Bonnie? Yeah, fuck? Where the fuck is he now?
You're a bitch, I hope you know that. Press the large black button beneath I Bonnie's would bow if you tie sit to release still. the power module. Damn it. This fuck nut. How the fuck are you even moving? You don't have any damn legs. You're just crawling Press the around large the back black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie I to release would, the power module. I would, but I can't find him. He's being a bitch. Why don't you get down here and you catch him? Am I supposed to click on him? <laughs> Son of a bitch! Motherfucker! As to not accidentally activate her, you have been provided with a flash beacon. <laughs> Motherfucker! Ah. What, wasn't supposed to click on him? No shit! Motion trigger, parts in service. Great job reaching parts in service. It seems that Funtime Freddy is... Great, now locate the button on... Great, now carefully locate and press the button. Great, now... Good job. The face plates should now be... X. Great work. You will now be required to remove the secondary power module from the Bonnie hand puppet. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Little fucker. <laughs> Motherfucker! I was reading the damn comments. <laughs> Great job. You've acquired both power modules. This completes your tasks for the night. Please exit the building through Funtime Fuck Auditorium, yeah! and we'll see you back here again tomorrow. Screw you, Pon Pon! You're a piece of shit! I still love you, though. It's okay, broski. But you're going in a trash can. Because I fucking hate you. We have this love-hate relationship. Ha! <laughs> Just kidding. That's me and Foxy, dumbass. I don't give a shit about Bonbon. Bon. I don't give a shit about Bonnie. I don't. I'm more of a foxy type of guy. Sorry. Alright. Haven't seen her yet. Daddy, she can make balloons. Have you seen her make balloons? Oh, Daddy, let me go. But I died. Now. What happened? What what's happening? Be still and quiet. What the fuck is this? You've been sleeping for quite a while. I think they noticed that you never left the building last night. The cameras were searching for you, but they couldn't find you. I have you hidden too well. I kidnapped. Don't be afraid. I'm not going to hurt you. I am a 
only going to keep you for a little while. Try not to wiggle, though. You're inside something that came from my old pizzeria. I don't think it was ever used. At least not the way it was meant to be used. Too dangerous. It's just big enough for one person to fit inside, but just barely. Am I in a suit? You're in the scooping room. Do you know why they call it the scooping room? It's because, dummy, this is the room where they use the scooper. I thought that would be obvious. Isn't that a fun name for something? The scooper. It sounds like something you would use for ice cream, or custard, or sprinkles. It sounds like something you would want at your birthday party to ensure that you get a heaping portion of every good thing. I wonder, though, if you were a freshly opened pint of ice cream, how you would feel about something with that name. Thankfully, I don't think a freshly opened pint of ice cream feels anything at all. Uh-oh. It sounds like someone else is in the building. Shh. spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. What the fuck is that?
Well, you guys, I'm going to end this uh, this stream here. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, be sure to click the like button down below. Leave a comment if you want to contact me. Also, be sure to subscribe if you're new. Hit that notification bell. Join the EXO family. I upload daily. I love you all so much. I will see you guys in the next EXO family video. Laters.